Hello guys and welcome to your 30 second Java tutorial in which we're going to be going over the two string method. Uh, now before we actually start with that, uh, uh, we want to add something else and yes I see that there's an error here and uh, we will actually implement the correct constructor or we will uh, code the correct constructor later. Uh, but for now let's add this line of code to our constructor uh, code right now. Uh, let's add system.out.println the full name is and we're gonna want to print out the full name and how we will do that is not by simply writing you know uh, plus first plus last plus you know plus middle what I meant you know Th that's that's boring you know let's let's do something else for now and let's write this now you guys are probably pretty confused right now because I just typed this and you know this isn't a string it's just you know it's a name object so what the heck is it doing here and that is where the next part of the code comes in and let me type something right now and explain it just as I'm done so as you can see I've just uh, typed public string to string a method and yeah, what does this do and it turns out that this is actually a built-in method that every object in Java has and what this to string method does is it returns a string and whenever the object is actually treated as a string so here we're we're clearly treating this the object the name object as a string so it really doesn't know what to do so the java compiler looks and it's it says oh well he's treating the object as a string now so does it have a two string method oh yes it does i probably want to return the string that this defines and uh as you can see it will in fact return a string because the return type is a string uh, so I have to return a new string instance and in the parameters we'll actually have uh, the string that we want to return and we'll just return first plus a space plus the middle name plus the another space and of course the last name and all it'll do is once again treat it as a string main method check for a two string method bam and it returns this string in place of the this originally where it was uh, treated as a string so that's all nice and all but does it actually work does it work I'm not sure well let's try to actually build the correct constructor so it will work let's see we're gonna have uh, we're gonna have a guy we're gonna have named Bob there we go Bob Bob the man uh, his middle name is gonna be Chuck or you know yeah, well, if you, it doesn't matter if you spell it correctly, you know. Nothing, not like this guy's real or anything. And, you know, his last name is going to be Jones or Jeans, you know, close enough. All right. Uh, and it's going to be separated through commas, of course, because they're arguments. Jeez. Uh, all right. So now that we've defined all the arguments for our constructor, let's actually run this program and see if it works. We're going to click the play button. Bam. What do we get? The full name is Bob Chuck Jeans. Well, that's that's quite nice. That's quite nice. And just so you guys know, it not only works with the, this reference when we reference the name object. Say if we wanted to write, you know, another string. Uh, it's like uh, system. All right, let's see if I can type correctly. Out. Dot If we wanted to write, once again, the name is, or the text. The text is. And then we wanted to uh, print out the same thing that we printed out for the constructor. We could once again we could put plus n, which is our name instance. And once again, because this name instance is treated as a string in this case, it's going to go to the class, going to go to this two string method, and it's going to replace that with this uh, string. So let's see if it works. And bam! Did it work? Did it work? Did it? Work? Oh! The text is Bob Chuck Jeans. So once again, very nice. Uh, everything works well, and I hope you guys have, have you know, gotten the gist of this tutorial, how to use toString, and uh, probably just, you know, some cases in which it could be useful, as as in, as it was in this case with the name. Uh, so anyways, guys, thank you very much for watching this uh, short, but, you know, hopefully sweet <laughs> tutorial, and I will see you in the next one. Peace.